Hello, Martha Alderson here. I'm also known as the Plot Whisperer for the work I do with writers and plot. And I am doing a transformational inspiration through nature series. And I thought I would share it with you today. I live at the beach and every day I walk along the beach and I marvel at nature. And I've always believed that if the great divine or the great unknown or the, you know, great spirit um, wished to communicate with us, that probably one great way to communicate is through nature. Um, and so I like to wonder about what I see in nature as I take my walk um, and what nature is trying to say to me. I always look for things that are unusual or out of the ordinary that I don't see every day and then wonder what that is trying to convey to me about my own life or try to teach me um, for my greatest good. So my goal with these transformational inspirations is to share with you what I spot and the insights gleaned with the hope that maybe the ideas will help you too. Um, so today I happen to spot a huge pod of dolphins. There's nothing more joyful than to see these creatures come out of the sea arch and dive back in and there was just a whole long line of them leisurely moving through the Monterey Bay in my sight um, which just always causes me to smile and stop. So dolphins represent the power of breath and of sound because of the way that they breathe and because of the sounds or the clicking that they make under underwater. So what this sort of represents then or allows me to start to think about myself is what are my words and thoughts creating for me today, right now? Um, joy versus tension. And personally I've been under a little bit of stress and tension um, because of outside forces and you know working to sort of dissipate that and um, try to stay in a good and balanced place. But it was really a great reminder to sort of stop for a minute and see what tension I was holding, where it was, and then to use the same technique that a dolphin uses when it comes up for air. And it's something I've learned earlier in um, something else that I was doing that's a great way to release tension. So with the release of a spout of air, just like a dolphin, when they dive down to go to, you know, look for food or whatever, and then they come back up for air, you can see the spout behind, you know, their head where they um, spout air, you know, release the water and um, take in oxygen. And you can do the same thing yourself to release tension and to cleanse your thoughts. So I'd like you to try it now, where you just sort of take a deep breath and then let it out in a sharp sort of spout, like a sharp release. So it's where you just let the tension release with the air as you're letting out your breath. Now ask yourself, as you do that and you start to cleanse your breath and cleanse your thoughts, how your thoughts and beliefs are supporting you right now in pursuit of your goals or how are they holding you back. It's just a short little meditation and it's a way for you to sort of stop, think about your own body, think about what's going on for yourself, how you're supporting yourself or not, and to be able to have a little technique to um, come to a better place of balance. So again, take a deep breath and then let it out as quickly and sharply sort of as you can. And as you let the air out, allow new ideas and new beliefs or thoughts to flood your mind for the greatest good. In other words, you're releasing the negativity or tension and you're drawing in um, positive or, you know, helpful, supportive energy, thoughts, and emotions for yourself. I'd like you for this week, because I'm going to put up one of these every week on my blog at MarthaAlderson.com. Um, I'd like you to try this dolphin technique every time you feel yourself stressing up 
or that you're under a lot of pressure or you can feel your thoughts sort of spinning around in your head in a non-productive way, just stop, take a deep breath. And as you let it go, ask yourself, what am I ridding myself of now? Draw in a new clean breath. And as you pull it in, pull into you the things that you know are going to best support you um, on your journey in life and to make for a happier and more pleasant day for yourself. So thank you for visiting and I'll see you next week for the next installment of Transformation Inspirations from Nature.